Okay folks, welcome back to Saving Miller. Let's make something new today. So, I have a duck coop that I want to have wheels on so I can move it. And I have actually been planning to make some wooden wheels uh, for a different purpose. But I thought, hey, this is a great opportunity to make a set of wheels for the duck coop. Uh, they're going to be wood, cut out of this plywood. And that should give me a really nice test case for how well these wheels will hold up, how strong they are. Um, and it's going to save me a little bit of money. Wheels this size are actually very hard to find. And I don't want pneumatic wheels out on the pasture. So we're going to make some wooden wheels today. Check it out. Okay, I'm not sure what went wrong there, but we we lost position and uh, things went very wrong. I'm glad I was right here. I stopped it. That rim is not going to be great, but uh, what I'm going to do is reposition the router 
and uh, we will see if we can finish this cut. This middle part is loose. We'll get that out of the way. So we'll see if we can get the others to turn out correctly. Well, that was a close call, but we got the last one cut out very nicely. This one turned out pretty good. We did have a little hitch there. So there you go. Made two wheels. Now, this was kind of a test case. I do intend to use these, uh, but I'm pretty pleased overall with how these turned out. The, I, ha I don't have any glue or fasteners on here, so these, these are actually tight enough to hold, hold themselves together. Uh, I definitely some uh, some improvements can be made to the cut file and my material is not great but it actually is quite strong so this is pretty cool I'm excited about it and uh, we'll see if we can refine this you might see more wheels in the future so there you go saving Miller -Rack.